Today, I'm going to show you something really new and different. Now, if you've been using Discord for a while, then it's time for you to become a pro on Discord. And when I say that, I mean getting more familiar with using Discord in a much faster way. Yes, so today we're going to learn some keyboard shortcuts within Discord. And there are a bunch of them, but I'm pretty sure that some of them will come in handy in some way. I personally use it a lot and it comes in handy, so make sure to check it out. And also stay tuned till the end of the video because in between I'm going to show you guys some secret easter egg bonus shortcuts which will bring up something really cool on your screen. Now just before I move on so you know I will be adding a pdf version of all keyboard shortcuts in the description below just so you don't have to come back to the video and look for a specific shortcut. So you can download the pdf or just print it out and hang it over the wall. Anyways aside from that let's get started. Starting with the message shortcuts. Now this only works when your discord is focused on a specific message and you can do that by just pressing on the tab button on your keyboard and moving your arrows to a specific message that you want. Now pressing E edits that specific message, backspace deletes the message, P pins a message, addition or plus adds a reaction and R replies to that specific message. Now the following ones are only when you're texting within the discord application. Ctrl plus A highlights everything within the text box, Ctrl plus B adds the bold format, Ctrl Ctrl plus C copies the specific text, Ctrl plus V pastes the copied text, Ctrl plus I adds the italic form and if you're not texting it also opens up the inbox section, Ctrl plus U adds the underline format and it also toggles anything on the right side of your screen. Ctrl plus X removes and copies the selected text at the same time. Ctrl plus Z undo a previous text and Ctrl plus Y reduce a previous text. Now here are some chat shortcuts. Pressing any letters or number keys focuses on the text area. Pressing escape marks a current channel as read. Page up and page down scrolls in the page up and down. Ctrl plus S opens up the sticker. Ctrl plus E opens up the emoji. Ctrl plus F opens up the find section at the top here. Ctrl plus G opens up the GIF section. Ctrl plus T or K opens up the search bar section to search for a server, DM or a channel. Ctrl plus P opens up the pin section in the specific channel or DMs. Shift plus escape marks the whole server as read. Shift plus page up or page down jumps to the oldest message or the latest message. However, if you want to check out the oldest message first, then you will have to do that before checking out the latest message. Ctrl plus Shift and T creates a private group. Ctrl plus Shift plus E marks unread messages as read in inbox. And Ctrl plus Shift plus U uploads a file. And now here are some shortcuts for voice and video. If you're receiving a call, pressing escape declines the incoming call. Ctrl plus this apostrophe thing starts a call in DM or a group chat. Ctrl plus enter answers an incoming call. Ctrl plus shift plus M toggles the mute when you're in call. And Ctrl plus shift plus D toggles the deafen when you are in call. Now let's talk about some shortcuts for navigation. Alt plus up and down navigates between channels or DMs. Alt plus right or left navigates between the page history. Ctrl plus Alt plus up or down navigates between servers. Alt plus shift plus up or down navigates between unread channels. Ctrl plus shift plus alt plus up or down navigates between unread channels with mention. Ctrl plus shift plus alt plus V navigates to current call. And Ctrl plus alt plus right or left toggles between the latest server and DM. Now here are some other extra shortcuts. Ctrl plus R refreshes Discord. Ctrl plus shift plus N opens up the create or join a server tab. Ctrl plus shift plus H takes to Discord's help website. And Ctrl plus slash opens up the keyboard shortcuts. However, not all shortcuts are mentioned there. And now finally, it's time for some Easter egg bonus shortcuts. To activate those Easter bonus shortcuts, you need to be on the keyboard shortcuts page. So to do that, just press Ctrl plus slash. Press H, H, right, N and K. Typing these after each other will bring up a cool effect within Discord. 
And as for the second one, when you're in the keyboard shortcut page, just press the arrows and you're going to hear some great sound. Anyways, that's all for today. That was pretty long. Must be pretty boring. But if you've made till the end here, you are a legend of mine. And I really appreciate it. Hopefully this was helpful. And let me know in the comments below which one do you think you will be using the most. Make sure to join my Discord server in the description below. And subscribe, leave a like, and see you in the upcoming video. Peace out.